Guys, it's Fonzie from DipYourCar.com. You know, doing videos, showing you guys different colors and different dip pearls and stuff like that is really fun. But when I get to do a video that's actually going to make a big impact on the dipping industry, those are the videos I get the most excited about. Today is one of those days I'm going to be able to show you something that's actually going to change the lives of people that use Plastida products on their vehicle on a day-to-day -day basis. So I'm going to show you exactly what the product is, how it works, and how to apply it. It's the Dip Your Car Dip Coat. It's Fonzie. Enjoy the video. Now this, guys, is Dip Coat. It comes in a 32-ounce spray bottle. It's very easy to apply. A little bit later, I'm going to show you how to apply it how much product you need to apply, and how often you need to apply it. But right now, let's run through some of the demos and actually what this product can do. It's an anti-mar and anti-scratch product. It's going to make a very big impact on how your Plasti Dip surface feels. It's going to make it much more slick, much more slippery, instead of a soft, grippy rubber feeling. It's going to make a huge impact on the ease of cleaning Plasti Dip. It's going to really resist staining, hard water spots, things like that. It's also going to enhance the color of Plasti Dip and enhance the pearl finish if you're doing a pearl finish. And it actually really helps with uh, supporting some UV protection. And we'll go over all this stuff in detail. Let's start off with the anti-scratch and anti-mar properties. Now, one thing that Dip Coat really excels at is providing scratch and mar resistance to dipped surfaces. Now, this is not a perfect bulletproof suit of armor for your dipped car. But as you can tell, it really makes an impact in avoiding and preventing those surface scratches. So if you do find yourself in those extreme conditions, whether you take your car off-roading or you're on a really busy highway every day with stuff flying at your car, any of those danger areas where you could potentially see surface scratches in your dip, the dip coat's going to build a thin layer of protection between the exposed dip and the outer elements and keep your dip looking really, really good. Now we've got our hood here. The entire thing is covered in black rubber dip spray. This side here is standard black rubber dip spray. This is rubber dip spray with an application of dip coat on it. Now, again, the first thing you're going to notice probably is they're two different colors. This is a little bit lighter of a black, and this is a darker, deeper, richer black. And as we said in the beginning of the video, the dip coat, one of the benefits of it is it's going to enhance the colors of both Plasti Dip colors as well as pearl finishes. Now, we're going to demonstrate just how much slicker and smoother the surface is versus standard rubber dip spray. Now, a rubber dip spray does feel really good, but it's a little soft and it's got a grippy type texture to it. After the dip coat is applied, it's much harder, much slicker, and much smoother. So, we've got two aerosol caps here. We're going to put them in about the same spot here on the hood. We're going to slowly tilt the hood up. We're going to see which, if there's any uh, impact on the surface here on which one slides down faster. Alright, the one with the dip coat has fallen down. The one with the rubber dip spray is still stuck. And eventually it makes its way down. On the other sides. And again, the dip coat goes down first, much slicker, much slipperier. And eventually, the rubber dip spray cap will go down. One of the first things you're going to notice when you apply the dip coat to your car is how much slicker and smoother it feels. It has a very good feel, almost like a vinyl or even smoother. It's one of the best benefits of the dip coat. Now here are the instructions on how to apply dip coat to your car. We've got the olive blueberry dipped uh, 911 turbo here. We've got our bottle of dip coat and we've got a microfiber towel. Now microfiber towels of course can be found at dipyourcar.com or almost anywhere. They're very very common but microfiber towel and dip coat is all you really need. As far as the dip surface, you want to have a clean dip surface, a dry dip surface, and a cool dip surface. Don't use dip coat on a dirty car. Don't use dip coat on a wet car, and don't use dip coat on a warm or hot car out in the direct sunlight. You want to get it in a garage, you want to get it into, into the shade, and you want a nice cool to the touch surface. So what you're going to do is you're going to spray the dip coat 
directly into the microfiber towel so that you can saturate one of the edges of a folded microfiber with the product. That's going to help it slide over the dipped surface really nice and easy. Now what I like to do on an entire car is I like to pick one panel at a time. So for example, I'm going to focus on this driver door and I'm going to just lightly mist the area and then I'm going to come in with that wet edge and I'm just going to drag that dip coat back and forth Make sure I hit every single inch. Make sure I get it all covered and coated. And that's one panel. Now if you see some streaking or you see some residue left over, that means you're either doing it on a hot car or you're putting too much on at one time. If you do see some streaking there, it's going to evaporate and it's going to dry and cure. You'll be fine. Now we're going to move on to the next panel and just dip coat the entire car. Okay, we've got a full application of dip coat. All of the dip surfaces on this car are dip coated. It's nice, dry, slick, and smooth. It's protected from mars and scratches, and it's ready for the road. So you're gonna ask yourself, how often should I be applying dip coat to my dipped car? Well, I'll tell you right off the bat, the first thing I like to do is if you have a car, a dipped car that's never had dip coat applied to it, the best thing you can do is go around the car and apply your dip coat to the dip surface, wait about 20 minutes, and then do the entire car again. The first time you apply dip coat to your car, you should do a double application. That'll really help build up a nice solid foundation of the product on the dipped surface. Everything after that is pretty much maintenance. So here's what I think. This car gets a really thorough wash once every week and a half or so. So my routine at this point, after it gets a real thorough wash every week and a half, bring it into the garage and throw a nice fresh coat of dip coat on it. So the average guideline is every time your car gets a really thorough wash or about every two weeks or so, you can reapply the dip coat. Now the dip coat is not only going to give your dipped car the protection from any potential surface scratches or marring, it's going to make that dip surface feel much more slick, much more slippery to the touch. It's going to make the dipped car easier to wash and more stain resistant. And it's also got a good dose of extra UV protection for daily exposure to the elements. Now this here is a 32 ounce bottle of dip coat. It's just under $28 on dipyourcar.com. Remember, you're going to be using about two ounces per application. And the suggested application frequency is anywhere between every week to every other week. So even if you use the most frequent application suggestion, use it every single week, one $28 bottle is going to give you about four months of protection on your dipped surfaces. That's the value that we really wanted to bring to you guys. It's something we worked really hard on for a long time, and we're very, very proud of it. This product is 100% exclusive to DipYourCar.com. The Dip Your Car resellers and installers will all be carrying it and we will be shipping this product internationally as well. If you have any questions about this product at all, email customer service at dipyourcar.com or you can call in and we'll walk you through any questions that you do have. This is something I'm extremely proud of personally and I can't wait to get it into your hands so you guys can enjoy the benefits. It's Fonzie, I'll see you on the next video.